Today I'm working on a 96 Ford F-250 with a 7.3 turbo diesel. Got a leaking pan gasket. And I'm going to show y'all how I get the fluid out of an automatic before you ever drop the pan. That way you don't get transmission fluid all over the place. I've got a shop vac, an old Freon tank, drill a hole in it. Got the hose running in the top. Got a nipple sticking out the side. Clear hose hooked to it. Got it sectioned together here. It's longer than the dipstick, so it should reach the bottom of the pan. Got the truck. Jacked up in the rear. That way all the fluid runs to the front. That way when I suck it out, it'll get just about every bit of it. Turn it on, and we're gonna see how long it takes to pull out all the fluid in, in the pan. It took eight minutes and 30 seconds. Put a shot back. Vacuum pump works better. I just wanted to show y'all it can be done with a shop vac too. Don't everybody have a vacuum pump, but most everybody's got a shop vac. You don't want to suck the old oil up in your shop vac, so that's the whole point of this tank. Let it sit a few minutes, and I'm going to turn it on again. Alright, it's been about five or ten minutes. I'll turn this thing on one more time, and See if it picks up any more. It's pretty much air. A little bit left. I just fixed today. I'm gonna just stop it right there. I'm gonna reset the camera up under the truck and snatch this pan off. I'm not even going to take a drain pan under there with me. Well, as you can see, I don't have any drain pan under here with me. No plug in the pan. 20 bolts I got to get out. Well, that's pretty easy though. Loose. Okay. Yeah, yeah, service. Since the transmission was rebuilt three or four years ago. Yeah, all these bolts loose. Alright. No need for a ratchet. Anymore. Is. Taking these bolts out. Time to get this mini out. Dripping all over you. All over the ground. All over everything. It's a disaster. But you got a pan that's four foot wide. 
I wouldn't advise doing this. I she done it the way I just did. Yeah, I found this laying in the pan and it's missing one right here. So I'm gonna check all these before I put this thing back together. Man, it ain't falling apart. I'm going down the road. Drip this fluid coming out. Put something around this other end. Let's filter. Tighten these up, go back to the top. Fix that porous fluid that I sucked out into these two jugs. See how much it is. We don't know how much to put back in it. gallon in it, start there and check it and see what, see how low it was. Four quarts in, I'm gonna take five, maybe six. Fill it back up. And it's good to go now. No more leaking transmission. Sucked it up. No problem. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and comment. Nothing else, just subscribe. Alright, see y'all on the next one.